Good day everyone, we are the group 2 and now we will present our work about MMDST. But before that, what is MMDST? MMDST is the Metro Manila Development Screening Test. It's a screening test to note for normalcy of the child's development and to determine any delays as well in children in 6 and a half years old and below. This is also modified and standardized by Dr. Phoebe Williams from the original Denver Developmental Screening Test or DDST by Dr. William K. Frankenberg. The purpose of the Metro Manila Developmental Screening Test is to measure the developmental delays of the child and evaluate the four aspects of developmental that will be discussed by Ms. Hala later. Please take note. The MMBST is not an intellectual test, also it is not a diagnostic test, and lastly, it is not a predictor of future adaptive or intellectual ability. So now let's go to the MMBST procedure. So first is to establish rapport with the parents or guardian. Second is to make the child um, comfortable as possible. Ginagawa natin to para um, makuha natin yung cooperation ng bata and magawa natin yung test ng maayos. Third one is to calculate the child's age. So ginagawa natin to para malaman natin kung ano yung task na ipapagawa natin sa bata. So need natin itanong sa guardian or parents ng bata yung um, birth date ng bata para makalculate natin yung exact age niya gamit yung um, formula na nasa screen. And after makalculate nung exact age ng bata is magdodraw tayo ng straight line dun sa test form according dun sa age na nakalculate natin. So, nalagyan na natin ang line. Ngayon, isiseselect na natin yung mga task na ipapagawa natin sa bata. After administering the test, we are now going to score the results. So, P for passed, F for failed, R for diffused, and NO for no opportunity. So, merong 105 um, test items meron sa MMTST pero hindi lahat pinapagawa sa bata kasi ang priority lang naman natin is yung mga items na nandoon sa age line ng bata. We have four aspects of child development evaluated by MMDST and DDST which are the personal social, language, fine motor adaptive, and gross motor skills. So our client here is in the age of 4 years, 3 months, and 13 days. And the first aspect that we are going to check is personal social development, which indicates the um, child's ability to get along with people and take care of himself. Good afternoon po ma'am. Uh, I'm Joaquin Quinones, your student nurse for today. So today ma'am, kaya po nandito tayo is mag-ask po ako ng permission sa inyo if okay lang po mag-perform ng MMDST or Metro Manila Developmental Screening Test sa pamangkin niyo po. Okay lang po. Hello! Anong pangalan mo? Ano? Titan! Ako nga pala si Ate IG, sa si Kuya Brian. Kagagawin tayo na activity. Madali lang naman to. Alam ko kaya mo to. Okay ba yun? Uh, so, ang una activity natin, tayo ka dito, sa gilid ko. Uniform mo to, diba? Diba? Uniform mo to. Kaya mo magsuot na ito, kahit wala si mami mo. No? Ah, sige, subukan mo. Galing naman ito, ati. Kaya mo yung ibutone? Sarado? O, subukan mo lang. Ganito, o. Kahit ako, di ako marunong, eh. Ganyan. So, ngayon naman, tutulungan naman dito ang magdamit. Tayo ka ulit.
Then next is the fine motor adaptive task, which indicates the child's ability to see and use his hand to pick up object and to draw. Ako dati jewel. Kaya alaman naman ako, di ba? Okay. Ang next natin gagawin, gagayahin mo yung ipodrawing ko. Ha? Okay? Ito. Drawing tayo, ha? Cross. Ayan. Tapos, ayan. Adari, ikaw. Drawing mo, ha? Yan, very good. Next natin gagawin, bilog. Meron ako mag-gawin ng bilog. Oh, ito, gagayahin mo ito, ha? Bilog, ganito. Bilog. Oh, ikaw. Ayan mo pala eh. Very good pala eh. Oh, last natin gagawin, mag-drawing ka naman ng tao, ha? Oh, sige, kain ko ulit. Pampabos ng energy yan. Dini. Dini. Oh, next natin gagawin, mag-drawing tayo ng tao. Ganito. Look mo. Ito yung ulo. Ito yung katawan. Paha. Saka kamay. Oh, ikaw. Kaya mo? Dali, drawing mo. Drawing mo yung ulo. Ayan. Ayan, ulo. Paha. Ito, yung ganito. Sige, ayan. Sa kabila. Ayan, tapos yung kamay. Ayan, very good. Oh. Third is to test the language development, which is about the child's ability to hear, follow direction, and to speak. Ganito. Um, anong gagawin mo kapag nilalamig ka? Napukumot, very good. Paano naman kapag napapagod ka? Kapag inaantok ka, anong gagawin mo? Kapag inaantok ka, anong gagawin mo? Hihiga. Very good. Eh, paano kapag nagugutom ka naman? Anong gagawin mo? Gagawagin mo si mama para kumain. Very good. Okay. Ang next natin gagawin is, aalamin natin kung nasaan ang lolokitong blocks na to. Pag nandito siya, nasa ibabaw. Kapag nandito, nandito siya sa loob. Kapag nandito, nasa ilalim. Okay? Start na tayo, ha? Kapag nandito, nasa taas siya, nasa ilalim. Very good. Kapag nandito, nasa taas siya, nasa ilalim. Isa pa. Last na to. Nasa, nasaan siya? Nasa taas, nasa loob. Very good. Next natin gagawin is, alamin natin kung ano yung kabalik tala ng isang bagay. O, halimbawa, ang aso, ang sounds niya, arf, arf. Ano naman ang sounds ng pusa? Miaw. Very good. <laughs> okay, next naman Kung yung gloves, sinusuot natin siya sa kamay Ano naman, saan naman sinusuot yung medyas? Sa paa Tama Okay Fourth and last aspect is the gross motor task That indicate the child's ability to sit, walk, and jump Okay, ang next natin gagawin Is magbabalas tayo ng isa lang yung paa natin Magbibilang tayo ng 1 to 10 Gagayaan mo ako ha, nakagayin no? Tapos may isang paa mo. Dali, ito. Yan. 1, 2, 3. Bilang tayo, ha? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay na. Very good. Ano naman natin gagawin? Ano? Tatanan ka pa punta sa akin. Isang paa lang. Ayan mo. Tatanan ka ganyan, no? Ganon. Dito ka, mula dito. Ayan. Punta sa akin, ha? Dito lang ako. Our second client is a child who's in age of 5 years, 2 months, and 13 days. Well, good morning po, sir. My name is Justin Pergabino, your student student. Ma'am, you did it po. Uh, Mag-aasta po ako, yung pwede po i-perform sa BASA, yung MNBSP, or yung Metro Manila Development Training Test. So, yung MNBSP po is para po malaman natin kung appropriate po yung uh, development ng bata sa ito. So, uh, anong pangalaman mo? 
Ha? Huh? Choco? Please, tatay. Ako si ate. Yes, please. So, okay na ba? Ipaalis yung garden mo. Ayan, sige. Okay lang kasi. Kaya mo na, ha? Because in the chart, there were only two activities that were aligned in his age level. So, what we're going to do is to let the child perform the nearest activity from the line. So, ato ako, kaya mo bang mag-ano, mag-damit yung mag-isa? Ay, ito na. Lakas mag-isa. Kaya mo ba siyang ano? Suba rin. Suba rin mo. Ito ako si Kuya Brian and ang next natin yung gagawin ay magdodraw. Marang ako ba magdodraw? Shapes lang. Gagayain mo lang yung gagawin ko. So, ito. Una. That's next. Tapos ito, piliin mo kung ano yung line na mahaba sa ibigraw nito. Asan yung mas mahabang line? Tama. So, may itatanong si Ate Justin. So, uh, pag nagugutom ka, anong ginagawa mo? Eh, pag napapagod ka, ano ginagawa mo? Ano ba pa rin niya? Pag nilalamig ka, ano ginagawa mo? Nagpupulong mo. Okay, very good. May tatanong sa ate kung anong kulay ka. Eto, anong kulay nito? Pink. Okay. Eto? Pink. Ah, eto? Red. Okay, very good. So, may itatanong ulit sa ate yung mga kabaligtaran. So, di ba ang kabaligtaran na, ay, ang umaga, ang kabaligtaran niya, babe. So, ang marami, ganun kabaligtaran niya? Mainit. Eh, yung malaki naman, ano kabaligtaran niya? Anong kabaligtaran na malaki? Maliit. Okay, very good. Ngayon naman, uh, magbabalance tayo. Kaya nyo ba magbalance? Like, yung isang paa mo ba? For 10 seconds. So, game. Okay. Balance na natin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34
in the video after asking the child permission if she could manage to do the activity without a guardian. There was no problem about it. Second is fine motor adaptive. She passed three which are copies plus sign, copy circle shape, and draw a man in three parts. Third is language. She passed three which are comprehending cold, tired, and hungry. Understanding three preposition which are in, on, and under, and answering the given opposite analogies. And last is gross motor. She passed three which are balance on one foot within 10 seconds, hops in one foot, and catching a ball. And the result she got in the MMDST was normal because she passed all 12 tests that were given to her. All the activities that were given to the child successfully performed. Therefore, the child's development is aligned with their age level. As you can see in the video, the 5-year-old child passed all the activities that were aligned to his age. First, in personal social, he buttons up, dresses without the supervision of the guardian, and separates from the guardian EC because in the video, as you can see, after asking permission from the child if he can manage to do the activities without his guardian, there was no problem about it at all. The second one is the fine motor adaptive. The child was able to copy the square shape, imitates the square shape, and drew a man in three parts and determining which is the longer line that was illustrated by the student nurse. The third is the language. He was able to comprehend cold, tired, and hungry. The child also recognized three different colors and answers the given opposite analogies. Lastly, the gross motor. The child balanced on one foot within 10 seconds, um, catches the ball, heel to toe walk, and backward heel to walk. He passed all the 14 tests that were done to him. Therefore, we conclude that there was no delays in each sector that was mentioned. The result of the MMDST was normal and all the activities that was given to him were successfully performed. Therefore, the child's development is aligned with, with his age level. Bing bing bam 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 Oh, 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 oh,